Hey y'all, it's Aisha, the girl who was getting yelled at by Kanye at the Donald Trump, <laughs> I mean Kanye West rally today in North Charleston. Do you expect the guy to me that TMC? Do you want to be that same person? And your face is covered so we don't even know who you are. Ooh. Ooh. He allowed people to come on stage to ask questions. I was one of those people selected. We went up there. He let mo numerous people go before me. And um, at the last five minutes, he allowed me to ask my question on gun reform, in which he did not answer. He just spewed out random facts and bragged about himself. Communities are disproportionately affected by gun violence. Okay. Her Aisha's comment is on gun violence in the United States. I live on a 4,000 acre ranch, and I could shoot AR-15s all day, 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 facts, without going to jail. And it feels weird because I grew up in Chicago. And then after that, um, he started to go on, on a rant and he started saying very like incorrect facts to his crowd. And I kept interrupting him and shouting over him the right, like the correct facts because he has a large platform and he shouldn't be saying incorrect things to people who look up to him. And then he stopped. He put the spotlight on me. And then he interrogated me in front of everyone um, for interrupting me, for interrupting him, even though like five minutes earlier, a white girl did the same thing and he caught her on stage, gave her a hug and everything. How do you feel at the end of the interview? I feel fine. I feel fine. Can I have a hug? Yeah. <laughs> And basically, once he kicked me off of stage after that, he then called me a sister soldier. And then he continued to say I wanted Wakanda, not America. And he kind of just talked badly about black women. So please don't vote for Kanye West because he's just not qualified, y'all. And he just ain't it. <laughs>